Hello, this is Myra with Joy of Color for Cooking. Today I have a really good summer recipe for you. We're going to take a quick look at the food pyramid because I want to burn it into your brain what a high nutrition food pyramid looks like. This means everything, particularly at the bottom, is something that you should be eating every day. And in my last show I talked to you about G-bombs that are superfoods that it's good to eat daily greens, beans, onions, mushrooms, beads, and seeds. In this recipe today, which is called chickpea tuna, there are beans and then there's scallions, which are onions. So there's two of the superfoods and then additional vegetables. So here we go. Today I went to a place nearby called Deborah's Natural Gourmet and I bought most of these ingredients there. This weekend, the new edition called Deborah's Backstore just opened. This has been in the works for a long time. It was a vision of Deborah's and her son, and it's very exciting to have it be open. So if you're around here, please go see it. And here we go. This was a two-part recipe because I did part of it at home and part of it here. So in this bowl is chickpeas, almonds, and kelp and lemon juice. This is silk tofu, red pepper, lettuce, tomatoes, chopped up celery, green onions, champagne vinegar, or it could be white vinegar, mustard powder and nutritional yeast, and Dijon mustard. This part was done in a food processor, the chickpeas and the almonds, lemon juice and kelp. This is all gonna go into the food processor. These things right over here, are the dressing. Again, in goes the silken tofu. In goes the nutritional yeast and mustard powder, champagne vinegar, mustard, Dijon, Push down some of this mustard that is on the side walls. There we go. This is not really designed for a shorter person because it's hard to see what's going on up there. All right. Now this is all going to go in this big bowl here with the chickpeas and I'm not going to use all of it because it's a lot. Before I do that, I'm going to be adding the red peppers, the celery, the scallions, see how pretty it is? I'll mix it up before I put the um, sauce in it. Yeah, it's real pretty. This has already been bought to some gatherings and many people do like it. Here we go. So you want it to be moist, but not too moist. And I'm gonna use a little bit to put on the bread. I brought both Ezekiel bread and Ezekiel tortilla because you can make it either way. It needs more. Here we go. A little bit more. Voila. Okay. For those of you who may have like had one hand at a certain point in your life, you realize that this hand actually does so many things that one begins to realize when, like this right now, just even just stirring this with one hand. This other hand actually usually is much more active. Okay, 
Here we go. Now I'm going to make two different things, which is first a roll up and I will take some of this from in here and use it for spreading. Use it for um, inside the tortilla and then put some greens. And then some chickpea tuna. This is lunch. Whenever I come to this cooking show, I'm like I'm always hungry and then it's my lunch. Okay, so here we go. Just roll it over and you can cut it in half. And then I'm gonna take this other two pieces of bread. Same thing, this was toasted. It is really nice on toast. I just got two other recipes, an eggless salad and an unchicken sa salad. And they're variations on this, so maybe I'll bring that to the next show. Those are definitely gonna be, for all the events of the summer, these are good things to bring. All right, and then I don't think I put any tomatoes on it, did I? I don't remember, I'll see when I go back at the film. And now, a nice, beautiful sal sandwich, which will be cut in half. All right, and Beautiful. This is a little bit more, slightly more time consuming from some of the recent ones. I've done a lot of short recipes, but it's still very doable and quick. And we'll move this over. Let's take a nice picture of this by itself. Here we go. I hope you try it. Let me know what you think. And I hope you have a new addition to your summer events to bring with you. Bye-bye.